heard you always by my side Why I always cry When I think of you I don't know what to do So I'm on my hands and knees Tell me what to do, please Cause I just don't I'm supposed to go At night in the cold I think of you and you hold Me in your arms That's when I dream that they warm And even in the rain My shelter from the pain Holy Spirit in me When I can't talk or see Cause the tears are in my eyes Blurry blur Say hello YouTube Say hello Why are you looking at me? Say hello Olive Olive say hello Say, it's the well here, and I am back again with another video today for you guys. Say that, Olive. Anyway, this is my niece, Olive. She's cranky right now because she's tired and it's her bedtime. It's really late, actually. It's like almost 11, 11 o'clock, but yeah. She's tired and about to go night-night. You go night-night? You go night-night? Actually, I'm about to give her back to her mom because she got a wet diaper and I'm not about to change her diaper. So give me a few moments, you guys. I'll be back. Okay, so I am back and I'm in my own room. Um, in case you haven't noticed that I moved in with my sister. She let me stay here. Um, you know, I still got to find job and pay rent, all that. E ECT, blah, blah, blah. Which I am looking for a job. So, y'all y'all stay tuned for that. But anyway, enough of that. This is my room. I'm not going to show you my whole room because it is not organized right now. And I don't have a bed. I don't have anything. I don't even, I don't even have a TV. So, but when I start working, I'm going to get all that stuff and give you guys a room tour. Once, once my room is fully furnished and decorated. So, as of right now, this video, I'm going to be doing a review on the Jordan Force Military Black. Yeah, from DH Gate. And actually, these shoes were free from DH Gate because on my previous video, um, they gave me the wrong pair of shoes, which was the um, Jordan 1 Lowe's um, Cardinals. And so they sent me a free pair of shoes and I picked the Jordan 4 Military Black. So they just came today. And so I thank God that I got free shoes and yeah, so, I mean, not every seller is going to send you free shoes when they mess up on your order, but I got lucky, so I'm happy about that. But yeah, so, <clears throat> let's get into this review. Um, a little about me and my channel. I do um, replica reviews on anything, AliExpress, DHK, um, Sheen, Fashion Nova Men. Um, yeah, I think I named them all. Um yeah um any replica website like that i do reviews on and that's basically what I, basically what i do on my channel i try to find replica items similar to the um high fashion price items which you could buy at a lower cost and it still kind of looks similar and yeah so that's what i do i do replica reviews on almost anything and everything 
So if you are new to my channel, uh, if you like the content, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, <clears throat> sorry, my sister is like walking around the house with sage, smoke sage in the house. And it's just really, really strong. So if I'm like coughing a lot and snuffling, it's because that's the reason. I uh, I cannot stand the smell of sage. But yeah, she's walking around with the, the sage incense stuff. It is... It's making my head a little woozy, but anyway, I'll be okay. But yeah, so let's get into this review. All right, so here is the package right here. Uh, yeah, hi, my address. Yep, this is the address. I mean, this is the package, not my address, that package. Yeah, so I'm gonna try to uh prompt my phone up some way, somehow. I really need a tripod. And if you guys are cur curious, are curious, please send me a tripod because I keep procrastinating on getting a tripod, and um, I never seem to get one. So yeah. But anyway, uh, I'll be back. I'm about to set up this phone real quick. Okay, so I set up my camera, and now I'm finally about to get into this video. Yeah. Okay, so these did not come with a box, unfortunately. It came in the normal, thin, plastic, wrapping, plastic paper that it normally comes in. Bubble wrap paper. It's very thin. I don't know why they put the shoes in. It's kind of um, plastic. I know because it's for low cost fare, shipping fare, but still, anybody can like tear a little hole and see what it is and steal your stuff. But I hate that they do that, but yeah. But if you want a box with your shoes, uh, make sure the seller has it on advertised on their page before you buy. If it says come with box and whatever else they have advertised, then it's going to come with the box. If it doesn't say that, it's not going to come with the box. Also, you could try messaging the um, seller to ask them, hey, can you send my shoes with a box? Um, they might charge you a little extra fee, but if you want a box, then... I'm pretty sure you'll pay the fee, but yeah. And also, thank you to all the new subscribers that subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much, and all the donations that I've gotten so far. And I just want to say thank you, and God bless each and every one of you. A special blessing to each and every one of you. Thank you so much. It really means a lot to me. And yeah. Anyway, I also thank God for these shoes too. Anything I get, I thank God. Thank you God for these shoes. Amen amen all right so here they are as i was saying they come in this bubble clear wrapping paper it looks like it came with a card like a um a jordan card or whatever more plastic 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 okay let's get through the plastic Oh, wow. It came with this Jordan card. It looked like old school. A very old school Jordan card right here. And it has the Jordan 4s on the back here. It looked like the type of advertisement that you would order shoes from the magazine back in the day. Back in the 90s where you used to have the magazine with the, uh, all the Jordan shoes and you order from it. From the magazine that's what this kind of reminds me of similar of but it's not a magazine but the pictures look like reminds me of that i used to have a bunch of those magazines when i was little the uh, jordan magazines where you could order from the catalog yes i am that old <laughs> and i remember begging my mom can she get them for me and you know she never had enough money but i still used to just you know be excited to look through the um magazines and hope one day I will have enough money to get it but yeah as a child that's one thing i always wanted was all the jordans i was a sneakerhead since i was little so yeah so this reminds me of that magazine you know back in the 90s and yeah enough of that and then let's take the shoes out why they look so big i don't know they look so big they look so big <clears throat> I 
<clears throat> that's sage <clears throat> comment down below if you guys like the smell of sage if you don't let me know that in the comment section because i do not like the smell of sage i do not like but yeah these look kind of big i i forgot what size i got these in i think i got a size up too big but yo i've been seeing everybody wear these like when i be in walmart or whatever store um i be seeing like a lot of people oh what is they're like paint or something I've been seeing everybody with these on, so these are like really popular right now. So even though these were released in um these were released May 21st, 2022. Um I did my Google research before this video. So these were released May 20 yeah, May 21st, 2022. And they are going on stock X for 137, go 377, and Amazon. 447 so amazon is pricing them at a high price right now but it seemed like stock x still got them at 137 dollars but depends on your size so if you have a big size i'm pretty sure stock x is going to charge more money but they are starting off at 137 on stock x and go 377 and yeah so just to give you guys a little heads up um, if you want to go the cheap route like me, I should just get them on DHgate. Um, oh my goodness. This is why I need a tripod. Anyway, if you want to go the cheap route like me, I should just get them on DHgate for about 50 bucks or $55. And yeah. <clears throat> Actually, these, the, oh, these are like, ooh, the smell is really strong on these. All right, anyway, let's get into this review. I wasted enough time so they came with some paper on the inside so they won't crease too much so we got that tissue paper on the inside okay let's start with the tongue here the tongue you get that jordan logo and he is not looking fat today he is looking skinny and yeah and the stitching is decent decent stitching it also says flight underneath the jordan logo right there it says flight and yeah um the stitching is not too bad um it looks pretty decent as i was saying i might swap out the laces and put in fat thicker white laces in these or you, you could swap them out for gray or black hey maybe even red you know so i am going to swap out the laces and put like fat chunky laces in these because i i like the chunky fat laces right now so anyway, on to the mesh part here. The mesh is not, the mesh is looking pretty good. Not too shabby, not too like um, weird where it's like missing holes or, you know, the glue messed up. The glue is absolutely fabulous on these, on the mesh here. You got some good um, squares, pretty perfect squares. I don't see any messed up glue anywhere, even on the, um, part right here the front part i don't see any messed up glue areas so they did really well on the mesh with the glue it looks pretty decent um uh, on to the side here um you get that off cream white you get the um like a i would say a tannish a tannish gray like a brownish tannish gray color suede the um the feel of it is kind of like a suede feel and yeah you get the um rubber black paint the paint job is looking really dope on these the paint job looks really good as i'm looking at it um yeah i don't see any messed up paint splatters you know the paint job is really good um you get the wings here the wings okay the inside of the uh the tongue the inside of the tongue you get the Air Jordan logo on there. Also on the inside, you get the Jordan logo on the inside. I don't know if y'all if y'all can see that, but yeah, you get the Jordan logo on the inside. And you get that um, nylon. It's like a nylon cloth feel on the inside. It's like a light gray color nylon fabric on the roundabout of the inside there um 
On the back side, you get the skinny man Jordan logo, not the fat man, the skinny man. Some reps, some fake, some fake J's have the fat man, but these have the skinny man. So yeah, and it's pretty durable. It's very, um, it's very um, firm, very firm on the back side here, and yeah, very firm on this. The hill, the hill. I don't, I always forget what this is called though. It's what you use to pull your shoes up when you put them on. And yeah, you get the um the white paint job all around. That bubble cushion for the extra support. If you want to wear these as beaters, you, you don't want to mess up your the real ones. I suggest you could wear these as beaters if you want. Or you could wear them just going out, you know, whatever. And also, okay, let's start on the um. Also, you get mesh on the tongue here. So on the tongue, all the way down, you get the mesh. All the way down. And yeah, it looks pretty decent in the front. All right, so let's start on the bottom part of the shoe. You get that full grid. You get the um, bubble. You get that um, grid. The um, firmity um, grip texture on the sole here. So if you're hooping, you get that extra firm um, gripness on the court. You ain't going to be slipping and sliding anywhere. You get that full grip on the bottom here, which to me feels very firm and sturdy. Very firm and sturdy. You get that Jordan logo, that skinny man. You get that skinny man on the bottom there. And yeah, um, the overall um, firmness, I would rate it uh, maybe like a 7 out of 10 for the firmness. Of the whole shoe uh, the stitching I would rate like a uh, I would say a, I don't know a five out of ten yeah five out of ten <laughs> I don't know why I just rated it five out of ten but over the overall shoe is pretty dope as you can see the overall shoe is pretty dope this part here yeah i think i showed you guys the whole thing i am going to do an on foot review too so stay tuned for that on foot review coming and yeah like i said i paid about almost a little over 50 for these almost 60 but not at 60 but almost 60 like 50 50 something 55 57 56 something like that i'm gonna leave the link for the shoes in the bio and make sure if you're interested, you could you could um, cop these. Um, yeah. Sorry, my niece is crying in the background, but yeah. Um. Anyway, these are so dope. Um. The leather on this part is very firm, very, you know. If I had if I had the um Jordan shoe, the original one, compared I uh, like comparison, um they look very similar. They will look very similar. And I feel like these passed the test of uh, rep replica. So yeah. And yeah. Um if you guys want to know any other questions, let me know in the comment section down below because I am free to answer all you guys' questions about DHgate and how to order and what to look for, what not to look for. Also, I recommend getting a size up because these are China size and China shoes run smaller than the US. So make sure if you're ordering, get a size up. And I already explained, I already explained the, bo the box situ situation. So if you want a box, just make sure they have, have it advertised on their page. Uh, shipping, shipping on these took about three weeks because these are replacements so originally it takes in general it takes three weeks for your shoes to come um if you live outside of the u.s like in a foreign state it takes about a week because you know china is already outside of the u.s so it takes like faster but for u.s customers you're waiting about three weeks for your shoes and yeah um please be patient a lot of people say that 
oh, their shoes are still in transit and, you know, um, they've been waiting longer than three weeks. Just trust the process. They are going to come. Sometimes the tracking number doesn't work. When you um, try to track your shoes, it says tracking not available or unavailable. Uh, it doesn't mean that they didn't ship out your shoes. It just means that um, their scanner didn't scan it right. So your shoes are will still be on the way. Because that happened to me before where I thought my shoes wasn't getting delivered because the tracking wasn't working. But they came anyway in the mail. So just trust the process, you guys. Just trust the process. And yeah, um, have any questions about DHgate, let me know. I am like the DHgate ex expert. I've been ordering shoes on DHgate for like years now. And so if you have any questions, just feel free to let me know in the comment section. Um, yeah, um, so I'm so happy I got these. Um, yeah, and um, I forgot what else I was gonna say. If your debit card ain't working on the website, I should just go into like Walmart or Walgreens, uh, Rite Aid, uh, Fred Meyers, um, any store that sells prepaid debit cards. I should just go in there and uploading the money on there to the prepaid and then it will work because sometimes the, your bank denies the um, DHK website because it's a foreign, a foreign website. So sometimes the bank denies your payment so if that happens just put the money on a prepaid debit card and it'll automatically work because that's what i had to do when i first started ordering from dhk i had to actually go to walmart and get a prepaid debit card just to order shoes and plus it's more safer because you upload the exact amount of money that you need you know so it's safer and it works that way so if you're having problems with your payment just put the money on a prepaid card that's just a little small advice for you guys. And yeah, so now I'm about to show you guys the on foot review. All right, let's get it. Yeah. Fox in this heat, cause it's hot in these LA streets. They ain't heard nothing yet. Cause this replica on set Coming through with the Orby guns Scared a nigga just for fun I rock replica on the regular I just fake but it's still similar Skid row ain't a place to be I rock chains in a fake gold tee Never stay outside too late A crackhead might steal your plate Sirens on each block A pimp just hit a thought Jaywalking, parks popping. We shopping, niggas still yapping. Flash the beast with the stereo. I just bought LA, here we go. Bopping heads with the mugs at the park. Baby kids still talking smart. Cow cash just hit, I just got paid. 200 on the card and three in the bank. Dollars that is, cause I'm broke. Cause skin rope ain't no joke. Helicopters all in the sky Thank God I don't get high Hollywood fame and fortune Like a sea with no ocean Tent set up on every block Niggas fighting over a spot To sleep, this ain't how it should be Got my people right here with me Struggling, I'm in the boat too Sad day, sad life, whoopie dee doo I got things to do Gotta get the blues, papers, cause I'm a game changer. Skid Row, see you later. It be, it be, it be, it be.